everyone, and welcome to the first episode of Trilobite Disco. Today I'm going to be talking about Ono Yuki. Onoyuki and his band make mainly instrumental music, but they incorporate lots of different instruments. And underneath it all there's the standard rock band format which keeps things energetic and upbeat. One thing I really like about Onoyuki's music is the way he uses melodies and layers them up with different instruments playing the melodies, sometimes over the top of uncommon time signatures. This makes things really interesting and I have a soft spot for this kind of music. And also, he keeps things very catchy and memorable at the same time as keeping them a little bit complex. This is something that's really hard to do and I think he pulls it off pretty naturally uh, in his songwriting. <laughs> Onoyuki himself at the cafe where he makes some serious cakes and I did an interview with him. It was my first ever interview in Japanese uh, so it was a bit shaky but here it is. あの、<笑> あの、<笑> なものがすごく好きだったけど、うんと、10代の終わりぐらいに東京に来て、そういう天銀カフェとか、あとスティーブライヒってすごく好き、ミニマルミュージックのものが好きになって、それを一緒にやりたいなっていうのはすごく思
ールインピザの音楽で、はい、あよくあ変,変拍子、うん、あ使ってる、うんね、あいろいろな表紙を重ね,、うん、重ねる、うんねえっと、そ,のその効果は何ですか、うん、その効果ね、うん、えっと。例えば表紙とかリズムを変えることによってあの聞いた人が一瞬耳がついてこないくなるですと思うんですけどそうするとあの曲の中にそういう部分があることによって曲自体の持ってる耐久性が増えると思ってて。あのその曲が何度でも聴けるようになると思ってます。で、何度でも自分が聴こう聴ける曲を作りたいから、その作った段階から自分の曲はもう何百回も何千回も聴くから、自分が飽きないようにで、変拍子とか表紙を変えることって、例えば山を登る時の手がかりとか足がかりみたいなもの。で僕はこういう丸くてつるっとした音楽よりはそういう手がかり足がかりになるものがたくさんある曲が好きです。災害とか台風とかすごく多いからそういう時に海はすごく荒れるし普段はすごく静かだしでそういう風がすごく吹いて木がたくさん揺れたり山とか森とかがすごく音を立てたり海がすごく音を立てたりとかいうそういう自然の音とかあの景色はすごく影響を受けてると思います。
たら早い。So that was the interview with Ono Yuki. I hope you enjoyed it. It was great to meet up with him and ask him some, some serious questions that I've been wanting to ask him about his music. All of the live footage from this video is from a live show that Ono Yuki and his band did at a venue called Nanahari in East Tokyo.、Uh, coming up next is a full track from that live show. It's called Fuga, not Fugu as I thought initially.、Um, and it comes from this album, which is called Tempestas. Which is a really good album, the latest one from the Ono Yuki band. Since this one, though, he has also put out a solo album, which is more singer songwriter y type stuff, but also some great material.、Um, and that's on this album, this is called Yoru Tohi. So, I hope you enjoy this next song. This is one of my favorites by Ono Yuki because it really displays some of the things that I like about his band、um, and the music that he makes. So, please enjoy.
So that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed watching it. I put some links below in the description to where you can find out more about Onoyuki's music and his discography. So please check those out. And thanks a lot for watching. This has been my first video that I've made and I'm going to hopefully make some more in the future. So thank you very much.